You know her name? Marianne Ann Chabry. Mary Ann? You aren't you very pretty. Well, Marianne, what can I do for you? I... I want to see the king. The king? Yes. What do you mean? I want to see him. Yes, but why come to me? Well, I... I was told I must first get a... a, 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 a petition. Petition? You mean a request for an audience? Yes, I guess so. Uh, I understand. You see... I want to tell him. What? How things really are. I don't think he realizes. He couldn't without trying to help or do something. I mean, oh, I don't know. <laughs> he didn't know. Think she would think it was so funny. Now, look here, Marianne. Last night, when I heard you speak at the cafe, I thought to myself, at least there's one man who can feel for the people and who understands them. They're suffering. I'm sorry. Oh, never mind. No, no, I, I shouldn't have laughed. There's no work to be had. All the mills and factories are closed. Yeah, I know. My mother is dead. We have no food, <laughs> no home, no money. It's settled only for ourselves. There are thousands like us. Oh, what do I mean? Hundreds of thousands. You see, and still you think the king doesn't know? He's not a monster. He's a man, a human being. But he's weak. He's stupid and vacillating. A man of his sort has no business wielding power. But he is the king. The king? Do you see that document? It's the Bill of Human Rights drawn up by the National Assembly. It doesn't ask the impossible. All it says is this. Be fair with us. Treat us like human beings. Give us the right to protect our daily bread, and we'll be happy. Little Marianne, don't despair. Sit down. Oh, I was such a to come here and bother you like this. I don't know what I was thinking about. You thought you could help, and so you can. How? You're one of the people. Assert yourself. Let your voice be heard. My voice? Take this money and buy some food for your no, family. No, 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 please. It isn't mine. It belongs to an aristocrat who stole it from the people. Jesus. But is it honest to do this? As honest as taxing the poor to feed the rich. I merely reverse the process. So now we'll go a marketing. Shall we? Let's see you smile. Yeah, but the the the, 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 the bill of, of Jaws. Keep it. the shop, and then the police came. Uh, but I escaped. 
Mary Ann. What's the matter? Mar she What is it? What do you want? Never mind. Let me in. I'm sorry, my children, but I shall have to take the furniture. Your taxes are overdue, and you haven't paid the rent either. I will pay you everything. I will get a job and pay whatever I owe. You had a job before, but you didn't pay your taxes. How could I pay you 50% of my earnings when all of it was enough to buy medicine, food, and milk for... Oh, I love it. I'm sorry, but that's not my business. Could you please leave me alone for a while? Leave you alone? I should say not. Well, let's see. What have we got here? Oh, please. Why don't you come over to my place sometime to see me? Can I? Maybe we could think of something there to satisfy this matter. So that's what you want. You rotten swine. You dirty dog, you filthy louse. You aren't satisfied to collect taxes, tithes, and rent. It isn't enough that we're hungry. That my brother there can't go because he hasn't enough to eat. That my mother had to die of starvation. There she lies. No, you even want that. No. I'd rather give you the furniture. Put us out in the street. I know you think we have no rights, but you're wrong. We have one and we'll keep one. The right to do with our bodies as we please. And you're not going to take 50% of that. You 